So this is the battery pack on this mobility scooter I'm just working on at the minute. It's obviously two batteries. Looks like a resettable fuse and a normal blade type fuse there that fits in the front end. That's your connector that connects onto the bottom of your scooter. So you can obviously pull this pack out and bring it inside and charge it if you need to. Which is a good idea, never seen that before. So basically I'm just going to test two batteries. You can test this, you can test the fuse. And that's about all you have to do on here really. So we'll get set up. Okay then, so we've got it set to volts DC. test each battery separate first so 12.5 volts so it's about half charged twelve point six seven volts and if you connect it in the middle it should be the actual power of the machine so 25 volts. So that's it. Turn it to continuity. Check the fuse. Uh, amp. The circuit breaker sort of thing. And then the fuse. That's all fine. So I've tested the battery, the fuse. And this uh, lot circuit breaker, it's 15 amp circuit breaker thing. I'll check the charger next. So I've got it all set up. I'm going to use my crocodile clips this time. There's the plug. I'm going to turn the power off. Don't want to accidentally short these pins out and damage it. Or short them to the body of the. Like that, you know what I mean? If you touch like that. You're going to make a contact between that and the uh, shield. shield. I'm going to try and do that so they don't touch. <laughs> so hopefully I've got them on the right pins. There's, there's three pins, so just keep going until you get your measurements. There you go. 27 volts DC. So that's going to be a good charging current on a charging voltage on a 24 volt battery system. So that's good. So turn the power off, you don't want to short them out again, and voltage should drop to naught. That's it.